Well, hey there, viewers. Doc here. Lovely Tuesday morning, June 29th. Been having some problems with the old F uh, 1997 F-150. The air conditioning compressor clutch has decided to freeze up on me. When it freezes up, that engine don't want to turn. Wow. 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 So it's time to get that replaced. But I'm not driving it anywhere because it could freeze up at any time. And if it freezes up and you're lucky and it shuts down the engine, hopefully not in the middle of the interstate. But my luck, I'd get to the parts store and come back out and it would be froze up. Which is what happened the last couple of days. Put the old camper in the backyard here. Went to move it back around front, the truck. That pulley froze up. Took about four hours for it to cool down enough to free up so I could drive it back around. Went to work yesterday down in the big city. Got back home, put the original battery back in it. That pulley decided to freeze up. So I'm not gonna take any chances today. Gotta take a day off of work. Ain't too happy about that. But I'm gonna come out here to truck number three. 1974 F-250 flatbed, good old reliable. I'm gonna get this fired up, run over to the big town, see if I can buy that part for the 97 F-150. Now I've heard that they don't have it on stock, I'll have to order it, but that's better than nothing. So out here in the backyard, see I couldn't even get this out the other day because the 150 was right here in front of it couldn't get this out so we're gonna fire this up this morning come out and check the fluids of course the radiator drained off had to put a gallon of antifreeze in there 50 50 mix that is the uh, back compartment of the brake cylinder it drained off usually does had to fill that up put a battery in it so that's all ready to go. Uh, gonna have to pull it out just a little bit. Empty all the crap off of the back. It's become a storage unit over the last year, so I gotta get all that off. Put the new sticker on the license plate. Then you can't see here, but I got just enough room to pull it out. I'm gonna have to shimmy it to get it out the corner there. But let's see if we can get this fired up. Hang on for a second while I get you out of the stand. All right. Yeah, I got a battery in it. Topped off the radiator. I'll have to check that after it's been running for a bit. Let it circulate the fluids. Probably top it off. Check the brakes and won't have brakes for a little bit but those might pump up pretty easy yeah it's going to take some pumping on the accelerator so let me back up here i've got one of these harbor freight 10 by 17 portable garages to keep it out of the weather and then i got some straps that i strapped to the truck so the shelter wouldn't blow away it's all unstrapped and I got just enough room to weasel in beside here. There's just not much room. Got some stuff on the back. I got to empty all that off. Let's crawl in here. See if we can get her to fire up. Do, do, do. I hope everybody's been doing okay on this hot summer. Make sure it's in neutral. Here we go. Hope we got a good connection. Yeah. Well, at least it's turning over. Plus, 
Happy to see that it. Let me juggle my hands around. Happy to see that it fired up. Oh, you can't see me. Well, that's not important. But hopefully, you can hear that engine. And that belt is squealing. All right. Well, let's see. I know I got the hood up. Let's see if I can coax this forward a bit. Well, I can't do that. I'm going to have to go move the camera stand. Hang on. Let's get out of this thing. Whoa. Good picture of the engine running. Let's get the old camera stand out of the way. While well, I'm here, I'll lower that hood. And we'll weasel back in. We can't move this forward a bit. Get it out in the sunshine. All right. Here we go. Oh, it sees the light of day. Oh. Barely got brakes. Well, there we go. Got it most of the way out of the shelter, but I don't have a whole lot of room maneuver I'm gonna to have to probably weasel it back and forth here get it out of this hole got my camping trailer there so I can get it out of this slot in the backyard get it around front get it readied up so I can drive it over to the parts store but thanks for coming along for the ride Hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, thanks for watching and commenting. Catch you next time.